I don't know how to make the first move. I mean, I know, but it's hard to try because what if I give him my number and he gives me another reason to cry? But here we are, two people sitting, drinking coffee with books to read. Waiters move in blurs around us, helping customers order what they need. How do I order courage? How do I order time? Do you think the universe can be paid in poems or does it hesitate to accept a rhyme? Because you seem nice. Uh, by the way, your hair falls like the type of man that plans a first date, who always texts before he calls, that checks in with his mother, that would tell her about a girl, talking about the way her hair smiled at him with the bounce of a curl. You seem kind. Maybe. With green eyes like blown glass, like the kind of place you want to have a picnic in where time forgets it still needs to pass. Maybe it's the book that you're reading, or your messy dark hair. I'm doing everything I can to look away, but I can't help but stare. Because if magnets were people, you're the most magnetic to ever be. If hard drives were women, I'm sorry. Uh, what was the next line supposed to be? So, so I, I don't know how to make the first move. With, I don't know where the menu lists, how to be less afraid. So I ask for the check and the waiter tells me, Oh, your bill was already paid. And I look at her confused. She looks at me like she knows. You know, if I were you, I would give him the poem before he goes. But see, the thing is, the poem was just a thought. So I secretly thank an angel when he comes up to me. I'd love to return the drink that you bought. <laughs>